Hello, friends, and welcome back to another episode of World of Warcraft 1, 2, 1, 10. We are back here playing the, uh, the Shadow Priest Pretha, I am Sea Turtle, 257, and we are coming upon Halloween, and Blizzard has given us a gift. Let's see what we get. Handful of treats. Complete quest. Achievement. Trick or treat. Awesome. Let's pop these bags open. Let's see here. Right click to open. And we got uh, candy. And. Okay. Garbage. <laughs> I got this on my. Uh, one of my other. Two of my other characters, as a matter of fact. And we didn't get a costume. So, that kind of sucks. But, if you look around your screen, yes, things have changed. Um, where are we going to find these quests at? Um, I, I changed my uh, UI up a little bit. So, instead of the unit frames and all that stuff being way up here, with the top bars being way up here, I moved it all down here, kind of out of the way, gave us a little bit more screen. I got rid of this thing that was up here. And I condensed it down to just durability, which is down here. Also, um, the latest video that came out, um, I had actually had that video recorded nine days prior, nine days ish prior to, uh, when it went live on YouTube, um, Basically, what happened is um, I recorded the video, and I was getting ready to... How do I get up there? Getting ready to, you know, get it ready to edit, and I kind of just didn't feel like doing it. But then I got sick. I got a little sick. Alright, we might need to... I need to do something about the volume... Um, a lot has happened since the last time that we played together. Um, basically, let's see, is there anything back here? Alright, there's that thing. This quest has got to be in that building. Um, some stuff, here he is, cool. Some stuff kind of went a little haywire here in the game with uh, my layout, my UI, and my add-ons, and all that kind of stuff, and so I, um, let's go do number three, Heart of Mock, Roger, some things went a little haywire, and I had to completely uninstall all my add-ons, including the UI, and the game itself. And I had to reinstall. And so, it took me a little while to get set up. Also, that's also been happening too. Um, my mouse has been acting kind of funky. Um, see, it's on the sensitivity. And if I do this, you know, it, it turns normal, right? But every, you know, now and again, randomly, um my mouse will forget or the computer will forget or something forgets that the mouse is um, that the sensitivity on the mouse is but has been set and it'll it'll just like to where there's like maximum or minimum I don't know which one it is but the one where if you just, like, look at the mouse, it moves. Also. Something else interesting. 
So the way that I used to play, I was a... I moved primarily with the mouse. I didn't move at all with the keyboard. See, there it goes. There, the, there, that was the mouse. <laughs> Barely touched it. Oh, boy. Wowzers. Um, what was I? There goes the mouse again. It makes it kind of tough to play. Oh, yeah. Uh, mouse movement. I didn't move at all with the keyboard. And now, kind of relearning how to play the game a bit. And I'm starting to like it, get used to it. Um, Pool Ace, our friend from uh, Warcraft with Friends, he is back. He's back in town. We haven't had an opportunity to record yet, though, because... He's been um, kind of recovering from his trip, and uh, we haven't really played much together at all. But let me know what you guys think of this uh, new layout. These guys are tough, man. I really am liking moving with the keyboard, though. Okay, got that. Good. Uh, Heart of Mach. Where's Mach? I guess Mach is not around. Oh, you know what? I think part of the problem is we are... Not that. <laughs> uh, and there's a... There's a repeatable in here. Okay. Um, let me... Fix this sound. Dialogue needs to be turned up a bit. Kanda. Who is this? Oh. <laughs> I'm floating in the air. Neat. Maybe that, uh, what I did with that volume there will help a little bit with the voices. The voices in our heads. Let's see. He should say something. How you doing, man? Yeah. All right.
There he is. I already got it. Okay. Did I already... Did I just do that? Did I get it the first time and, like, not realize it? Let's get rid of all these. These are in the way. Alright. Okay. Just hop on this guy here. Smart's chest. Ugh. Pardon me. Let me get a drink real quick. Get a drink of my coffee. What does this guy got want us to do? Obtain Smots Chest and Blush Cape of Thrain. Okay. Also, some other cool stuff that's going on. Is. Um. I started playing a healer. And that has actually been quite fun. I've ran, I mean, we're just starting off. I mean, um, I've ran two dungeons with her. I'm playing a, uh, a, um, a, um, what is it? Dwarf Shaman. <laughs> And that's been, uh, I'm actually really enjoying that. Playing Resto Shaman on a dwarf. And I think I'm... I think I'm pretty much done playing the uh, the mage for now. I'm kind of getting tired of DPS. that all right we need to go here and we can also leave this area if we want to we have um, we can go to all these places <laughs> Oh, this is for Halloween. You know what? I don't know what that stuff's going to do. I was going to say, maybe we could do that. Maybe in the next video, instead of playing our quest line, we'll just go ahead and we'll do... Um, we'll, we'll go off the script a little bit and do that Halloween stuff. Um, I was kind of hoping we'd get a, uh, kind of hoping we would get a, uh, <clears throat> costume. I was playing my other characters, and, um, on a few of them, I got a, I got a costume that, that you wear, and it puts you in a costume for about an hour. That was, uh, that was, uh, a lot of fun. And it wouldn't be hard to do, cause what can I do for you? Mist veiled giblets, giblets. See you around. Hey there. Hi. See you later. All right. 
Yeah, because that's going to take... That would take us to... Uh, I don't know where it's going to take us. <laughs> but, um... Go to Stormwind and... No, don't fall off. Oh, we're already on the Eastern Kingdom, so... I should have known that already. But I didn't. Guess what? Level 36. And we got a new spell. Let's see, I need to find this guy. He's in here. Hello. What can I do for you? Give me some XP. How's that sound? For the alliance. That's right, for the alliance. And there's another one, I think. Is there another one here? Yes. No. There's not. Oh, there goes that mouse again. I don't know why it's doing that. I tried looking it up. I didn't find really much of anything. If anybody out there knows what's going on, please feel free to tell me. Oh. I got a few new mounts. I went and got that one. Let's put him on number nine. And I think my new favorite one is... Where is it? Here we go. the sandstone drake that is a two person mount when you get into this mount you <gasps> it goes dark too that's awesome look where is that button at Wow, that was really cool. That's what it looks like normal, but if you're in uh, shadow form, your mount goes into shadow form. And you turn into the mount, so I can ride another person on there, like, let's say, uh, Pool Ace, for instance. When we do another um, Warcraft with Friends episode, you'll likely see me using this mount for him to uh, ride on so we can get around and stay together and not get lost. And then uh, this bear is pretty cool too. Does he have a shadow? Okay, no. He just looks like that. The um, Amani Battle Bear from the um, I can't remember what the place is called. I'm horrible with that kind of stuff. But, yeah. So, I also... Let's see here. Let's go do... Let's go head off. What is this? Yeah. Let's go right off into the distance here. And, um... So I found this guy on YouTube, and I've been watching his videos. It's pretty interesting. Um, he never really played World of Warcraft past um, uh, the Burning Crusade, so the the first expansion of the game, if memory serves me correctly. Um, he has, however, played... Where am I going? We need to go this way, I think. He has played... Um, Vanilla WoW. And he played it exclusively. Um, he's played it on private servers, and, and he played retail and private servers, and he played it for you know, forever, 
pretty much. Can I get there from here? If that's a cave, I'm gonna be upset. <laughs> but. So here's a guy that's really only played vanilla. But he's got a series on YouTube. His name is Supa Soka. S O U P A S O K A. And um, he has a. Uh, There's our friend. He's got a series where he plays in Legion. He um, created a, an undead rogue. And um, the first episode was really cool because he's never played past, you know, the Burning Crusade. So everything in the, the uh, starting out area is... Um, post cataclysm so he's never seen any of that content I mean the map is different because of everything that happened and cataclysm and all that stuff and <clears throat> but in the second episode he um, boosted his character to 100 and he went and did uh, who we gotta kill here All right, we'll come back for that one. Oh, there he is. And so he's been playing the uh, Legion content. And it's pretty interesting to watch, actually. All right, quit walking into the monkeys, man. The gorillas. I really need to talk to you. I am on the madris. I would definitely recommend that to anybody that wants to see a vanilla player derp around in the newest content of the game. It's, uh, it's very entertaining. I think we're going to head on back and call this episode here for now. We are at 24 and a half minutes in this video by now, roughly there. Um, just wanted to get on and let you guys know what's been going on lately. Still trying to learn how to... <laughs> control this character but um thank you guys for watching I'm glad you guys picked my video out of the millions on YouTube to watch <laughs> um well, that's a long walk back ain't it long walk back down to there you know what? We have a spell that we need to put on the board, don't we? No, we don't. This one. Avoid eruption. Was it that one? Let me...
Okay. Yeah, I've learned a new passive effect. Okay. Void Bolt. Okay, cool. I don't know what it does. I think it's some sort of AoE type situation. But that's cool. Let's uh, dodge this guy. We'll, um, we'll finish quest number one there, a giant's feast. And, uh, turn in this quest that we just did in the next go-around. I know it's right here, but I want to keep this one hopefully somewhat shorter than half an hour. But, um, yep. You guys are awesome. Thank you all for watching. Can't wait for the next episode. Check you guys later. Take care. Bye-bye.